Good morning everyone! I am Teacher Dominic and for today's lesson, I will be discussing the different planets in the solar system. Are you class ready? Good morning class! Before we start our class discussion, please pick up the pieces of dirt under your chair and arrange your chair properly. Okay? So now, please stand up for the opening prayer. In the name of the Father, and of the Son, and of the Holy Spirit, Amen. Okay, class, you may now settle down. Thank you. Now, for our short review, who would like to share what we have discussed during the last meeting? Anyone? Okay, brave soul. Yes, Christian. That's right. Oh, how about you? Yes, Ella. Very good. Let's cover how to your classmates because all of their answers are correct. Okay, I'm very glad that you really learned a lot from our class discussion. But now, remember that the Earth moves through space with two major ways. First one is, yes, the rotation. And the second one is, revolution. When we say rotation, it means the spinning of the Earth. While revolution, it is the moving of the earth around what? Around sun. That's right. Okay, so before we proceed to our main discussion, we will have an activity. Okay, the title of our activity for today is Quiz Quiz Trade. Are you familiar with that? So, to start, please stand up. All of you guys, stand up. Yes. And then, raise your hand and then find a partner. Okay? Everyone should have their partner. Okay? And then, I will be giving you this index cards, okay? And then for the quiz quiz tray, there is a word over there written in front. And then at the back, there is a definition. Can you check your index card, everyone? Okay, very good. So you will have your partner guess the word, and the other one will also try to say or tell the definition. Did you get it? Okay, very good. Then after that, you will exchange your partner, but how? Raise your hand. So after you are done with the first partner, raise your hand and try to find another partner. Okay, crystal clear? Yes! So, once I call it time, oh, time, then you will now pass all the index card and we will have a group sharing. Okay, thank you. You may now start. Okay, time is up class. Submit your index card to the front. Okay, thank you. Now, let's have a group sharing. Let's start with... Okay, raise your hand. Okay, Mark, yes. How did you find our activity today? Is it fun? Where did you learn the dog? Wow, that's great. How about you, um, Fiona? Yes. What word did you get from our index card? Jupiter. Okay, can you tell us about Jupiter? Okay, Jupiter is called what? It is the home of the biggest storms and it's called the Great Red Spot. Let's move on to our discussion and I think you're already um, aware of what we're going to discuss today. Am I right? Yes. Oh, I heard some of you guessing it right. So for the discussion, you will have Teacher Brenda. Let's move on to the outer planets. So Jupiter is the biggest planet and the solar system, remember, it is the biggest is covered with thick clouds and there is no solid ground on Jupiter. So let's move on to Saturn. So Saturn is huge and has stunningly beautiful rings. There is a ring, okay? You don't need to put a ring on it. But the Saturn has its own ring. These are pieces of comets, asteroids, ice and dust as well as rocks. And Saturn is made mostly of gases. It has a lot of helium, and then helium is what we use for our balloons. Can you still follow? We still have two outer planets to discuss. Okay, shake your body and shake your minds. Okay, and to the last planet that we have here is Uranus. Okay, all together, let's read the seventh planet of the solar system, and is the first planet discovered by the means of a telescope. It is the only planet that rotates on its side. So this is the first ever the planet that was discovered using a telescope. So imagine if you were a discoverer. Jessica. Okay, Jessica is a discoverer using her telescope. As she is using it, looking at the sky, at the night sky, she discovered a planet. Okay, so Uranus also has a ring. However, the rings, mostly made up 
of dark particles that for you to see it, you need to use a telescope. Here we are with the last outer planet, the eighth planet from the sun and the first planet to be discovered using what? A mathematical calculation. Before we end our session, you will be doing a diagram showing, of course, the different planets in the solar system. Okay, five minutes. Can you do it? After five minutes, submit all your works for class sharing. Okay, let's give everyone a round of applause. Yes, good job. Okay, to sum up our discussion, so how these eight planets move in the space? Yes, Danica. Okay. Oh, face your classmate. Very good. Before we end, what do you think is the importance of knowing this planet? Who can share? Okay, that will be your class recitation. That will be your exit ticket. Okay, I want to hear every one of you. Okay, let's start with... Yes, Joe. Very good. Now it's almost time. So before we leave, I want you to get one fourth sheet of paper for our short quiz. This is a five-item quiz. Okay, I will just read it twice. So no cheating. I can see you at the back. One. How many planets are there in our solar system? How many planets do we have in our solar system? A, 7, B, 8, C, 5, D, 9. Next, which is the hottest planet on our solar system or in our solar system? Which one is the hottest planet? A, Jupiter, B, Uranus, C, Venus, or D, Mercury? Third question, what planet has the largest ring system? Which planet has the largest ring system? Okay, A, Saturn, B, Earth, C, Mars, or D, Neptune. Next, fourth question, the first planet discovered by Miss of a telescope. The first planet discovered by Miss of a telescope, A, is Venus, B, Saturn, C, Uranus, or D, Neptune. Last, okay, last, or which planet is the most likely candidate for a future human habitat? Which planet do you think is a future human habitat? A. Mercury, B. Mars, C. Jupiter, or D. Venus. Okay, once you're done, let's change papers with your classmate or with your submit and let's check. For your assignment, please get your notebook and copy this. So that's all for today. Please stand up for our closing prayer. In the name of the Father, and of the Son, and of the Holy Spirit, Amen. That's all for today. Goodbye everyone and I'll see you tomorrow. Thank you!